Okay, everybody. Welcome back to Casual Gaming. I'm gonna be playing Ricochet Infinity. Which is, uh, well, actually this is not the first game of this series. It's like the fourth one. I've been trying to play the others. Actually, it doesn't work as well as I would like. For recording purposes. So I'm going for this version. It's not the first time I ever play this game on this channel, even. I have done a couple of, well, I did a couple of streams last uh, year. Uh, as part of a pre-show, I did a few, like, uh, customized levels in here. Um, you can choose, like, user-made uh, levels that get uh, featured and, and, and updated pretty much every day. But you can also play the actual game, which is uh, what I'm going to be doing now. 145 levels. You know, uh, this could be a very long playthrough. I'm, I am pretty sure it will be. So maybe I will not try to do the entire game at once. So after, I don't know, a few parts, I will take a rest and get back to catch the, to um, hack me hard. So we can get to see another hack before the end of the year, right? I'm not sure by when you will be watching this. I'm recording this in late January, just for you to get an idea. But yeah, we have all of these worlds, three, six, nine. So 14 levels each. So yeah, again, this is an Arcanoid slash breakout game with, of course, different mechanics, different graphics, music, of course, is different. Start new game from any level. Yeah, I play the first level in order to test it out, but of course, uh, I'm going to start it from scratch. So the other levels are locked, of course. Let's go! This type of game will not have the best type of commentary. The names are funny. Dance till you drop. So there are golden rings in this. Yeah, like Sonic. I think they give you extra points. Of course there are power-ups. So wait, why is it indicating the trajectory is it going to be having? Is it because it's the first level or...? A safety bumper and a nuclear beam, which is the item that apparently... Okay, that ring is uh, silver because I already got it. But there are two of them which I haven't collected yet, which is very unfortunate that it saves the data from previously. Alright, this laser should be enough to get the other ring. Alright, I lost a life, actually. Alright, let me see if I can... Uh Hmm. No bounce is going to actually help me get this uh, remaining ring. Again, it's uh, probably a pretty useless collectible. I'm using the mouse, by the way. That's how you play this. Is it enough? No, it's not. Alright, at least I got one of the objectives ready. So yeah, this could be a very long game. Or playthrough rather, because I think a ga the game itself is long. I'm not gonna be, uh, play customized levels as part of this playthrough. If I do something like that, would be something casual, just... You know, to fuck around a little bit. Well, that was a nice coincidence. Continue. Ready. How to recall. Oh, teleporters. Use and recall. Let's learn how to effectively steer the ball in the flight using recall. Simply click and hold the right mouse button and pull the ball towards your ship. Oh, 
Oh, actually we saw this in um, Shatter. Also known as Cheater. Interesting, you recall it basically, you control the direction or you calculate the direction in which you, it's gonna end up do going. Alright. That was pretty cool. If I'm not mistaken, you have infinite tries, so we, we, you don't have to worry, we don't have to worry about lives. Ready. Iron helpers. I guess by now we know why they're called helpers. And the golden rings are randomly appearing from below. Already got 4 out of 5. Here's the last one. I think you get that, like trophies, collectibles, if you get the 5 things. So I guess it's uh, like interesting for the sake of completion. I know this level is a little noisy. You know, I miss power-ups. They are not as they, they don't appear as often as I would like. Alright, this should the bullets according to the direction of the ball. So I guess it's up to me to finish the level right now, right? That's pretty good. Let's continue. More teleporters. Ready. Recall and ship movement. Recall pulls uh, pulls the ball towards your ship. Posi position your sil your ship, sorry, to the left or right as you use recall by holding the right mouse button. To okay, it's the exact same instruction basically. Okay, these are the bricks that I actually have to like destroy in order to complete the level. They're gonna come by their uh, on their own. So I just have to wait until the blocks like show up. One more to go. Pretty creative mechanics. This is just the first world, so imagine. Moon buggy. Use recall any time. Remember, you can use recall any time or any on any level. Try using it here to pull the ball towards your ship when the ball is above the moon buggy. Oh, I just noticed it was a it's a, it's a car, uh, a buggy. Yeah. Yeah, but I need to get it up there, so it's a little bit of there's a little bit of patience involved. I don't see the rings. Ah, oh, there you are. Yeah, let, let... Is it really necessary to use the recall here? Let me get all the rings first. Alright, got a shield expander. Alright, that's a shrinker. Three roll. Blossom. Ball catcher. Causes the ball to stick to your ship's deflector. Use the left mouse to relaunch the ball. If you wish uh, to avoid catching the ball, you can hold down the left mouse button. As long as this button is held down, the ball will bounce normally and will not be caught. Alright, that's actually good to know. Because that bouncing, I mean, that stoppage. Oh, I can actually, like, cause an explosion by pressing or by clicking the left button a second time or while it is in this form. Very interesting. I still have one golden ring, so I'd rather wait for it. Fuck it up. So, yeah, I mean, if you want to go back and, and, and play this level again. Start from any level. So, yeah, this one indicates if you get all the golden coins, uh, rings, 
or not. So let's uh complete that. Right. But you do have to play the level again, basically. And it's only one ring that you have to collect. So you don't have to like go through all the trouble of getting all of them. So yeah, that's what he wanted. Can I just leave the level? Does it count? Yes, it counts it. Nice. Alright, let's do one more stage. Ready. Recall training. Well, this being all about recalling, right? Yeah, but this is an interesting level for training, actually. No, I actually want to... Okay, to steer the ball, position your ship to left and right. That's what I've been doing. Okay, you, you basically have to place yourself in a in a side, on a side, and then use the recall move. I don't want to beat the level before you get the rings. Nice. Slow ball. I guess that's easier to control. There you go. Alright, since this was kind of short, let's do one more. Level 7, so we can at, at least complete half of the world. That would be pretty good already. So we can attempt to finish it next time. Red power-ups. Watch, uh, watch out for all red power-ups, they typically modify your ship or ball in ways that you will not like. So this one is bad then? A fastball? I mean, at times that could be a good thing, at times could be a bad one. Alright. Oh, lighting ball. That goes through everything, right? No, it has an ex expanding power. Okay, I need to get more golden rings. I'm a, I mean, not about to beat the level, but that's an extra life, isn't it? Yeah, when, when the golden rings move like this, like going super unpredictably, and also. It goes one by one, so unless you don't get this one, the other ones will not show up. Hmm. So yeah, one thing, I mean, there are thousands and thousands of created levels. I remember getting this game a long time ago. Oh, okay, now two. A very long time ago. And there were already plenty of levels. And they keep updating even today, believe it or not. 3 out of 5. So yeah, I need to be lucky. I guess in the meantime, we can just go for the bricks. Okay, that was a nice coincidence. A beautiful one. Okay, now it's going horizontally. Could help me. Even though it's not even breaking a single brick. Alright, we're a shield expander. That was close. In terms of. Oh my god, that was so close. In terms of the golden ring. Yeah, these things will take a while. So yeah, this is Breakout slash Arcanoid, but not quite like that. I mean, the gameplay is exactly the same, but the power-ups and the, some of the mechanics. I mean, it's like Shattered in that sense. Probably Shattered is more of a, um, you know, more like a different game though. Because it has bosses and everything. I don't, I don't think this game has bosses.
Nice, at least I got that objective out of the way quickly enough. Or sooner than I thought it would take me. That was a pretty nice finisher. Alright guys, this is it for today. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time with more Ricochet Infinity.